Hey everybody, hope you're doing real good today. Gonna make a video today on an EDC carry knife. The knife I used to carry is this one in the black sheath here. Sheath is pretty worn already. We got this at uh, gun show years ago. And the knife inside is a folding knife. Bought at Walmart probably about seven years ago. And it's really served its purpose, but it's time to move on. Just noticing right now the crack right down here by the pin. So you can tell I've yeah, it's split right there, so you can tell it's had its use. A uh, simple folding knife, 10 bucks, Walmart special. I've seen it even go, now it's like almost 20 bucks, and I think, you know, I got a good deal for 10 bucks when I bought it. But uh, keep a razor sharp. And it served, like you say, it served its purpose. It's got a chip at the end of the blade right there, too, if you notice that right there. So, a buddy of mine was telling me the other day, he says, it's time to move on and get yourself a real knife. Stop carrying such a flimsy knife. And we were looking around, and he told me about a name brand that he thought was real good. And they're called Elkridge Knives. And this is a fixed blade. And I right off, right off the bat when I first saw it, I knew I liked it a lot. It's a real sturdy blade. The overall length of the blade is nine and a half inches. The blade itself is four inches. And uh, it's the Elk Ridge Hunter model ER 085. 440 stainless blade with a full tang and the wood itself on the handle, now y'all have to help me out, anybody knows anything about these blades. It's a mixed uh, tone blade handle, and it's burl wood and coco bolo. So I don't know which one is which. Anybody knows anything about those colors or the type of wood, please let me know so I'm more informed. The site where we were at, I had no information on that. It's got the stainless finger guard. And, of course, like you saw before, it came in the brown leather sheath. Extremely sharp, because we don't need to show you, demonstrate with a piece of paper or anything. When I was first putting, putting this into a handle, I'm still getting used to doing that into the sheath. I already cut right into it with one good swipe, so shows you how sharp this thing is. It's got a nice weight balance to it. I think it's real sweet. Yeah. Finally decide to get something fixed instead of folded because you can consider a folded knife like an unloaded semi-automatic pistol. Somebody comes up to you and you have to defend yourself. By the time you pull your uh, folded knife out of the sheath and then extend the blade from the handle, he's already on top of you. Instead, now with carrying a, the fixed blade, it's like a loaded gun. Because all you got to do is pull it out of the sheath and you're ready to rock and roll. So, I don't know why I've never thought about having a fixed blade before, but I tell you what, I definitely would not go to uh, back to a folding knife after ha handling this. So anyway, this is just a simple EDC carry uh, video on a carry knife that I'll be having for a long time. And I sh I'm sure this will serve its purpose as well. Anybody knows much about these blades and wants to leave a few comments on what they feel about the uh, Elkridge brand, please do so. Especially if you can inform me on, like you say, what is what wood. The burl wood and the coco bolo. Thank you all for watching this video. Hope it was halfway decent video. And y'all take care of yourselves. Be safe out there.